Hi, this is Ben Thomas with UST Training, and this is a Tank Savvy Minute. Today I want to talk to you about something that is particularly important, ethanol and gasoline. If you're in a state that mandates E10 or 10% ethanol, then you've got E10 formulated fuels. We're here at a particular site, and if you open up the containment sump and look at the turbine sump, what do you see here? A whole lot of corrosion going on. There's all sorts of corrosion happening on top of the uh, pump, as well as you can see the corrosion happening on the copper tubing. We have reason to believe that this is a result of E10 corrosion. What is happening here is that there is these really small holes in the tank top and vapor carrying ethanol is getting into the containment sump, turning into acetic acid and rotting out the metal. This is a condition that is not good and if you have E10 you should be very concerned that the ethanol in your system is leaking into your containment sump and causing this level of corrosion. We actually are going to shoot a video about this and lo and behold, here it is. And so this is actually a per chance meeting. This is not a staged thing. We actually found E10 when we went to go shoot this ethanol video. Be very concerned about water in your system. Be very concerned about water in your system. This is Ben Thomas with UST Training, and this has been a corrosion tank savvy minute.